Guys, back to some more Lego Marvel's Avengers, and this is the tenth episode, right? The tenth episode. Um, I know I kind of just low key, no pun intended, just came back without any uh, attention or just telling you guys this yet. But uh, I just decided to do this since you know the brand new Avengers game is out, and uh, I am very skeptical if I will even get the game or play it on the channel because it just it doesn't look like a good game. I, it, it just has really bad gameplay. I don't think it looks that good. The character designs look okay. I mean, I mean, I I don't know. I just I I don't know why, but I don't really have any um, inspiration to get that game whatsoever. I mean, if I do get it, what's so? If I do get it by any means, I um I won't get it like now because it's sixty bucks, and I don't think sixty bucks is worth a game that I don't think looks that good. So, yeah, but that's a real shame because I'm a huge Avengers fan, but because of that, we're back playing Lego Avengers. So, you know, I love Legos, I love Avengers, so... And the uh, other Avengers game looks a bit disappointing. And I'm sorry if you hear screaming in the background, and I bet it's very disturbing, but um, I have my uh, uh, niece, in fact, two of them are playing in the bathtub together so they're very loud they're always very loud so I hope you can hear me more than you can hear them and if you can't it's a bit of a problem I bet you can hear me more right but yeah because of that I'm gonna try and talk as much as possible so you guys or maybe I should turn this up there you go alright that's uh El Capitan Okay. Oh, hang on. There's a character inside of there. Chitari, if you could just... Oh. That happened in this movie as well. One of the best theme songs of all time. Can you take a better one? Probably. But this is easily one of the best. Like, as for games, then yeah, there is definitely better. Like Red Dead Redemption 2, the theme in that is way better than this. The Last of Us theme's better. Um, the Batman Arkham City theme is dope. The God of War theme is okay. Of course, Witcher has its very variations of different songs. Now, I might have bad news for you guys. Um, the Lego Star Wars The Skywalker Saga game... Um, the release date still is unknown, and that might be a bad sign because if it comes out too late, the bad news of that is that's supposed to be the very last Lego game for me to ever play on the channel, then I'll retire from it. But if we don't get a release date, I might never be able to get, get that play that game on the channel, and I might never be able to finish the Lego series with a certain game unless it's this, so it might be this. Who knows? It's only a might, so you don't, you guys don't have to worry about that. So let's just destroy these things for a minute. Actually, before I started recording this, I actually was uh, teaching my niece to play a little bit. She was liking it a lot. She was, you know, happy, screaming... Because she thinks it's cool, the fact that just a mini remote can control Legos. She loves Legos as well. Yeah, I'm teaching her to like all that. She's even starting to like Spider-Man.
she never really, like, every time I try putting on a, uh, Spider-Man movie for her, she doesn't want to, even though it feels like she does. What if next she starts liking Scarlett Johansson? That, alright, that would be a little bit of a problem. I mean, first of all, that my girl. You better stay away. I'm just kidding. If a girl likes her, I don't give a shit. If it's a guy, we fighting. Oh, I need, I need uh, Black Widow, baby. Is this the part where Hulk comes out? That'd be good, because we haven't played as Hulk through a lot of this game. I know a lot of you guys probably thought I was going to be done with the series, but not to see the title ending, I'm not going to, you know, play a series. Except with probably Witcher, because I'm a little stuck on it. Unless I find, like, a way to... I, I, I'm just taking a break from it right now. I'm taking a break from it right now. I had no idea how to pass it, so it's just a good time to take a little bit of a break, you know? There you go. Get out the fucking... I need someone to get out of my way, like, now. Do it, baby. Yeah, guys, tell me in the comments what do you think the next LEGO Marvel game will be. Do you think it'll be LEGO Avengers 2 or LEGO uh, Super Heroes 3? Me, I mean, I'll take Super Heroes 3 if they'll do, like, Fantastic Four and X-Men again. They took the Guardians route, which is alright. I didn't know why the Guardians weren't in this, because they're part of the MCU and they were Infinity War. But the first Avengers film is phenomenal. That actually... Uh, I mean, I don't know. Best film would probably go to this, but that final battle in Endgame just really, like, that alone just makes it a great movie. Before that, alright, I gotta be honest, it, it wasn't the best out of all the Avengers before that. Shit, as long as you're here, sounds like a party to me. I'm always angry. This part was dope in the movie. Why couldn't Hulk have a moment like this in Endgame? He really could have. Where people least expect it, but Hulk comes out and he wrecks the place. Like, I mean, he destroys everything. Especially Thanos. Does that mean he'd be the one to kill Thanos? No. I mean, he could have been, but I don't... Yeah, I, I, I agree. I don't think he would be the best choice to kill Thanos. I don't know if he would have won, though. I mean, it would have sucked for having him get his ass beat again. Okay, maybe if he if he do, did end up losing, do not, you know, have him go cry and then hide again. That shot is so dope. I love that moment in the movie. That part, like, oh my god. Alright, so we unlocked the Avengers. Assemble. We completed that level. We unlocked Iron Mark 7. Thor. America Chavez. What about Hulk?
yeah, we are gonna continue the story. Duh! After that, I'm not gonna, like, not continue. That was a great way to end the level, to be honest. Facts. Yeah, I don't like how Hulk got his ass beat, then he cried, and then hid. That should have made him more angry. That's what's supposed to happen with Hulk. The, the, like, the more you hit him, like, the angrier he gets, and the angrier he gets, the stronger he gets. With Thanos, he just kept hitting him too much. He couldn't get even angrier. I bet he was trying, though. Some people would probably think, though, Hulk could have came out in Endgame, but he just wouldn't fight Thanos. I, I wouldn't mind that. All right, I wouldn't mind that. People would, Hulk would have people cheering in the theater if he just came out. All right. Very disappointed that what they did with an, him in Endgame. They want to do a Hulk versus Wolverine movie, but he, he might come out for that one. I mean, I'm not going to say he will because we had hope in Endgame and then we got disappointed. But, I mean, here's the thing. It's cool and all. Like, I love the animated film and that's a cool fight. But, I mean, it's just not going to be... If you want to have uh, Hulk come out for another draw, just, I don't think... You should have, I think you should have had that moment in like Endgame, you know? Alright, that's it. Ugh. The fuck? Alright, that's it. Ugh, we got them all. Ah, fall off the... Man, you didn't fall. Alright, after I give Baby a boost here, I'm probably gonna end the video. Actually, before that. Thank you guys for watching the 10th episode of LEGO Marvel's Avengers. Come back for part 11, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.